hello students in this tutorial we are learning how to add google calendar to app sheet as a data source for this we will first go to google calendar calendar dot google and here you it will pick your google id if you are uh, you are signed in with your id so here you are to create a new uh, here in this interface here you want to create new calendar I have created already a calendar uh, um, with the name of let's say uh, let me create new uh, calendar for you let's say it's a task management app calendar to record tasks is the description and create calendar google calendar is creating this uh, calendar for us and the calendar is created now let's go to the word app sheet editor and here let's go to the data tab here let's add a new data table uh, clicking this you will see uh, here i already connected this uh, uh, data google calendar but let me uh, let me delete that to show you that how i can uh, how i can uh, connect it again uh, with sources and let me delete it here and now let me repeat the task let me uh, i am going to the data tab and here i want to go to the calendar let me refresh let me refresh and here let me go to the data tab and new calendar and here now we have no calendar uh, data source but to to add to connect to the data uh, google calendar to connect to the google calendar to connect app sheet to the google uh, to the google calendar i will click this new source and in the new source you can go to the google calendar here and it required the sign in procedure is there permission procedure formalities and now i am my calendar is now connected to app sheet uh, my google calendar is now connected to app sheet and here i go to google calendar it is connected and i want to pick a calendar from there let's me let me uh, pick a calendar from google calendar and the task management app calendar let me take that calendar and remember students this calendar will serve the purpose will serve will play the role as a data table make sure please learn this that this task management app calendar will serve is a is uh, a data table on the top of this we will uh, uh, we will build ui a view on it uh, it automatically add one map view but we don't need that we need to delete that so now the data table uh, task management app calendar data table is there let me uh, make some changes to add to view column and here i am to make some of its uh, um, table uh, columns uh, editable and some uneditable uh, let me it uneditable uh, attendees let me make the attendees uneditable unedit and let me make the uh, meet link 
uh, editable it is not uh, editable so make it editable so those two changes i will make and there i let me make this also mm, editable it's done i am done with it now let me build uh, a view on top of this uh, task management calendar let me build a view means meetings view and it is also very important view uh, uh, students let me create a view on the top of this uh, calendar here we go let me create a new view what is the name of this view the name of this view is meetings you will enjoy students this view so let me make this view on the top of google task manager and um, card view is fine okay let me um, place this view in the main um, side menu now here it is menu and uh, let me change the display let's say meeting is there any yeah okay fine and later on we will uh, we will it is the card view i will uh, customize it but let me first uh, create one uh, meeting let me create one meeting here uh, the title is uh, weekly weekly sales meeting let's say weekly sales meeting and it should be it should start from uh, six means let's say from from 6 p.m to 6 30 get automatically added 30 minutes to it and the location is i online and yes it is confirmed it's today what's the web link if we have uh, uh doing uh, let's say uh, uh, if we are doing on the zoom then we will uh, 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 add the link over here let me add the meet link uh, for that we will go to the meet google meet meet dot google and here um, new meeting create a meeting for later on pick this um, uh, the url paste it over here link meet on meet on google meet okay so the description is to discuss sales matters to discuss sales matters of the week okay and let me save it okay now here let me change the uh, the 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 layout here i will change the layout let me go to the meetings let me save the all the changes so that we have the new updates now we have the new we will have the new updates yes meetings we have one meeting and let me change the card will we um, and we don't need uh, this top uh, title no thumbnail here we need no top i don't need all this and here we need the thumbnail later on i will change the thumbnail and here i want a start date start time 
here I want the finish time end time yes and join with the google meet open url and i don't want this okay none so there we go and let me change one thing here in the data in the in the table in this the table task management app calendar on which we build this meeting view view and here we have one thumbnail uh, column and here I need to change one little thing that is the title it will pick now the title is a thumbnail the text icon uh, uh, formula and in the text icon I uh, ask the uh, app sheet that please make a thumbnail a text thumbnail where you write the title of the meeting and there we go you will see now if I change you will see now it will be an interesting thumbnail wait for eight weekly sales meeting good and we are done so if we go to the meeting here you can see we have one meeting which says weekly sales meeting it will start from 6 to 6 30 pm today and you can join with google meet and you can open the web url link if it is on some uh, some other tool if we are using we are meeting using some other tool we will be going there and from here we can generate the meeting uh, um, email to to notify everyone that should uh, who should uh, join the meeting so this is how we connect to google calendar and this is how we build views on top of google calendar thank you so much students